Yesterday we cleaned out our new house. We put away every single tool. We swept every single room. And we officially turned it over to the painters. Aww. Hallelujah. I asked Joel and the kids what they wanted to do with our newfound freedom. You know what they said? Come here. You know what they said. Look in! Look in! Look in! Our big. So here we are meshing the two worlds, lagoon and RVing. We're here at the lagoon's RV park. We purchased this RV from Camping World a year ago. I cannot believe it's been a year. We celebrated Lincoln's birthday last year. We went on our very first dirt biking trip and you know where I forgot all of the food. We installed a washer and dryer to make our longer trips a little more convenient and we have been able to start stocking it with things that we're going to need. Something we've learned is RVing is definitely for the family and requires the whole family. would never know that it's a hundred degrees outside. <laughs> I say we hang out and wait for the sun to go down just a little bit. <laughs> I, do you guys want to watch a movie while, while we wait for the sun to go down? You want to go now? Guys, it is so hot outside. I'll go now. my bones. I can feel it in my face. I can feel the winds of change. You live and you learn, and I hope I've seen enough to make something right and make up for what I. had a fun time at Lagoon. Joel is happy to just not being at work. And I'm not gonna lie, we just got churros. <laughs> um, walking through these gates and being in our RV park is gonna be nice. Welcome. I love the temperature of the night. I love how many trees there are. Lady, hello. She's like, where did you guys leave me? She got to stay in a nice air conditioned Come RVE. Here. Hi. Hi. Okay, 
Do you feel like today was restful? Oh yeah. That's the only thing I wanted for you was just to take the day off. And I didn't really think of the house too much. It was the perfect mental distraction. Yep, just I agree. Total vacation for a day, felt good. And anytime I check my emails, I hit it from you. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did good. <laughs> if I stand here, Cody, do you promise you won't let me get hit? Yeah. <laughs> okay. You guys are soaking wet and you don't even want to go in, huh? Nope. I think this is what summer is all about, you know? What? And not good, not clean? It's like... <laughs> not clean? Are you not clean? Uh, I mean, uh, uh, so a, little, a little sweaty? Uh, a little extra. A little sweaty? I am obsessed with all of the trees. I'm also obsessed with the... Uh, Color of Boston shoes. That's yes. weird. Boston got new ones. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking that we need to get a few more movies for the kids. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. We have Rocket this. Man, Shrek, yeah. And then this one. Kind of the same like movies over and over again. Obviously, they don't really care. This is one of my favorite ways to spend in the RV is watching movies. And I know that sounds like, ah. <laughs> yeah, what, what's the point? But it, it's different. It's amazing. It feels different. It feels different. And plus you guys ran like crazy. So I think they're ready to call it an evening. The kids have these Henry Weinhardt cream sodas. And every time they, they drink out of it, it fizzes out the top. So luckily... We have these, and they have a closable lid. Show my light blue one. It's, I think it's the best color, the light blue. So Cody has like a blue one, but and Lincoln has black. But they got mixed up, so they got switched up for today. Also they show did. mine. Mine's like the best color ever. Yep, they are pretty sweet. There you go. And I like that they have a closable lid. And when you're close, you can suck in it. Really good. <laughs> okay. I like it. <laughs> what are you looking at? Looking out the window. Huh? Looking out the window. You see the neighbors having a campfire? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, good night. Good night, lady. All right, we don't want to be too creepy. <laughs> but I did see the campfire. Got pillows all over the place. Are you guys finally situated? Mm-hmm. My yeah. gosh, are you looking out the window too? Yeah, there's like a fire, so we're watching it and like the RVs and the lights outside. Does it look pretty? Yeah. And the trees in the background. Aww. Okay. Good night, you two. Good night. Love you. Love you. Oh, yeah. Smell that. Oh. Look at those animals. I can smell from here. Oh, I smell so nice. Good morning, everyone. We are taking Lady on a walk. I mean, Lady, like, we know that every we go on a RV park to RV park we take lady and she loves it outside she loves smelling the trees and like she loves all the different campsites and there's mud right there she's not walk in it um you can in the background you can hear the roller coasters getting tested and the, you can maybe hear the animals behind us yeah, there's a bunch of animals over that way yeah it's like a petting zoo thing. Yeah, but we're, we just woke up and we're taking Lady on a walk. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Lady. Hey. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Um, Thanks for letting me hi. sleep. You're welcome. I seriously was like, okay, I know Joel needs to sleep in, but come on, Joel. You need to wake up. <laughs> no, you can't do Sleep that. forever in a trailer. Do you want to know what I find incredible is how dark it gets with all the blinds closed. I noticed that this morning because I was like, I have no idea what time it is because it is so dark with all the shades down, which I like, I love. Oh yeah, I'm torn on it because I like waking up to the dark and sleeping in late, but I also really like waking up to the sunlight, but today was a sleep with the shades on today. It was shades needed. Okay, which leads me to my next thing. Did anyone hear a Rain? huge bang last night? Yes, I did. Oh, the fire. What was that? I think it was a fire. No. Okay. I, a I knew Lincoln was sleeping on the top bunk last night, 
And so I just knew he fell down. I was like, he just fell off the top bunk because I, I heard the hit and I felt the hit. Hmm. And so I came, he was up there, all the kids were asleep, everything was good. So I'm like, did somebody like get into any of the like shelves outside? I, don't think so. I felt it. And then I'm like, somebody hit our RV. Have you walked around and looked? I haven't, but we need to. Should I go check? <laughs> it was loud and it shook. <gasps> You're so sure. It feels good to be able to use the things that we bought, you know, for it in here. Haven't Don't used it. it. Haven't used the new toaster yet. Don't rip the cards, guys. You gotta be really careful with them. I don't know what card that is, but we don't need it. Yeah. Yes, it's a wild what is it? card. It's a wild card? No. It's an actual it wild card? Shuffle hands. Yeah, I it's told him that is a card. Yes, right away. You have to shuffle your hands, like I don't know. Is that like a new card or something? No, oh. it's like you gotta. It shows you how to shuffle Either you your shuffle hands. the deck again that you draw from, or you sh uh, trade someone. Yeah, oh. but is it part of the playing? Yeah, yeah. is it a game card? Oh, put it no. in. Put it in the pile. It's not a. Yes, it, is. it is. Okay, put you it in gotta the listen to Cody because he probably knows better than you, Lincoln. Go put it in the thing. Mm. Hurry. And it's also write your own rules cards. Write your own. Are there? That seems like crazy. I that's don't a, like these. That's cards. chaos. What one is it? Shuffle hands. I don't know what it means. So can we throw it away? <gasps> no. Don't <laughs> throw away the cards. We're trying to throw away cards. I think this is kind of moment of truth here. <clears throat> we haven't used this new toaster, and what I'm hoping is that it's no. cute yes. and functional, and not just cute. Not just a pretty face. Yeah. I bet she's a workhorse too. I called Joel my workhorse the other day, and he called me his show. Okay, I go first. I'm like, I can't work like you. I can't work as hard as you. I'm not a workhorse. Just a little show pony. Yeah. There's a lot of things, but when I push the button, nothing happens. Are you plugged in? Yeah, I'm plugged in. Is this on? Yeah. Okay, I think you gotta push it down. Oh, and then you. And then push your button. Oh, there you go. Okay. But I think you still have to adjust it though. No, I did. I put it on three. That's not, was that going to be enough? I mean, it smells like a new toaster, you know? <laughs> oh, yeah, wow. Holy cow. Oh, that kind of stinks. I mean, just like a new toaster. You, and I did read in the reviews that kind of has to burn out. Or oh, whatever. I bet it does. Like, I think that's really normal. I'll tell you what's not normal is. Smells like toaster waffles. Is the smell of. Absolute trash. egg. Trash. Egg. Trash. What happened? We winterized it. It was totally fine. We did the washer and dryer, and I think water got stagnant there, maybe. You just gotta put a new anode rod in, and you're good. Trash is ready, so. I don't know what that means, but I think we need to get whatever that is. Okay, now it just smells really good like a buttery toaster muffin bagel. What is this? A toaster bagel? What is this? English muffin. An English muffin! Okay, take a pause for like a second and get your breakfast. Leave your cards just how they are and just eat your breakfast. Eat your breakfast. Cody, you want some? Okay, I got yes. this for Sean. I turned this down. Okay. I like a good girl. Oh. Okay, you want. Okay, you want. I don't know. Breakfast is over. I want you to get all of your things. It is 1020 and checkout is at 11. So we actually, <laughs> I have a feeling we're going to um, get the late checkout fee applied because we've got to, uh, I don't think we're going to be ready. Thank you guys so much for watching our quick little day and a half getaway. We especially want to thank Camping World. They have been our partner over the last year and it has been one of my favorite partnerships that I've ever done. If you guys are interested in getting a new RV or renting an RV, They've got all sorts of things on their website. I will put their website in the description. Also, if you're just in need of any type of camping gear or accessories, parts for your RV, camping, they have an entire website and lots of stores all over the place. How many times, Joel, have we gone um, either camping or RVing and we've needed new parts for I things? I intentionally camp somewhere around them because <laughs> There's always something and, and they, they, always, they have always have what you need. Um, and that was even before we, we, that was before we partnered with them. Yeah, yeah. 
That was Sanibel, when, Florida. Yes, I was trying to think of what trip it was when we went to Florida. Yeah. Stopped at a camping world, got the things that we need to fix because we were renting an RV and there were a lot of things wrong with it. And we were like, okay, we know this isn't ours, but we need to make the trip functional. So, all right, make sure to check them out. They will be in the description and we'll see you all in our next video. Bye guys. Bye guys.